Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So this is going to be a tag video. I love tag videos because they are easy, they're easy to watch. I can watch them while I am uh, cooking or doing my makeup or just listen in the back while I listen to how people answer the questions. It's really, really nice. They're fun, they're easy. It's a quick video to film and I thought that I should do my version of the invade my privacy tag so i've seen this tag a lot on youtube i've watched so many of them and i thought that it would be a great idea for me to do my invade my privacy tag of course i've got the questions on my phone if you would like to see this video then yes let's get into it let's get started <laughs> so the first question is did you wake up cranky not today i actually woke up in a good mood normally i wake up in a good mood i'm a morning person the second question is would you date an 18 year old at your current age girl <laughs> blaze a boy hell no i'm not i'm not trying to be put in jail or something i am far from being 18 i am not 22 i'm not 23 listen no and yeah my life will not accommodate a blazer boy at this point in time blazer boy 18 still matric i know it's been nice but no number three is do you prefer to be friends with girls or boys uh, for me, I've always been friends with boys, like for as long as I know, because boys are just not problematic like girls are. Girls have issues, girls want to air out their issues, girls want to blast you on social media, girls want to do all this thing, whereas with boys you can just hang out, chill, be on your merry way so as far as i've known i've only had a handful of girlfriends and mostly guy friends like and it's fun for me it's easy it's stress-free it's yes let's keep it moving kind of thing so yes number four would you ever smell at a stranger i've done it many many times just <laughs> I'm kidding. But I do. I mean, I smile at a stranger. Only if the stranger has a warm, friendly face. I don't typically just smile at somebody who looks like a serial killer. No. Number five, can you commit to one person? Of course. I mean, I mean, you can window shop, right? But commit to one person? Yeah. Yes, of course I can commit to one person. Yes, yes. Number six, how do you look right now? Got a red lip, got a white shirt on, got a little necklace on, that's it, hair done, that's pretty much that. Number seven, what exactly are you wearing right now? Oh man, you can see it, okay, I already said it, but I'm wearing a white shirt, I'm wearing leggings, black leggings, uh, flip flops, <laughs> um, what else? That, that's it, that's it, I'm chilling at home, so yeah. How often do you listen to music every single day? I am a music lover, so I listen to music every single day. Whether I'm in the car, at home, at work, even while I'm working at work, I'm listening to music. So, yes, love it. Uh, number nine, do you wear jeans or sweats more? Anyone who knows me knows I live in jeans. I love jeans. I'm always wearing jeans. I'm a fan of jeans. That's just how that is. Yes. Number 10, do you think your life will change dramatically before 2020? 2020 is like now, okay? So... Knowing me and my attitude towards life, yes, I would certainly hope that my life changes before 2020, but we, we can't be too sure, so I'm, I'm not really sure, but I'm hoping that it does. I'm hoping that it does. Question 11 is, are you an introvert or an extrovert? I am an introvert. By heart, I'm an introvert. I spend a lot of my time by myself. I enjoy being in my own space. I'm not somebody who's all about, hey, let's go out, let's go here. No, no, I travel by myself if I want to. So yes, for the most part, I'm an introvert. Uh, it doesn't necessarily mean that I can't mingle with other people. I can, but for a certain amount of time and then like an hour later, I have to go home because I want to be in my own space. But yeah, I'm an introvert. If the person you like says that they like someone else, what would you say? I'd say, well, I go be gay, but... You can't really do anything about it. Like, I wouldn't stop that person from, you know, trying their luck with that other person or something like that. But I, I'd be hurt about it, obviously. I'd be kind of gutted about it. But I'm not going to act immaturely and, you know, throw my toys out the cot and stuff. I'd be like, I, you know, you would have been happy here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, just, just let it go. Just let it go, man. It's... You know, you win some, you lose some. 
13, are you good at hiding your feelings? Absolutely not. I wear my heart on my sleeve. I say what I'm feeling. If I'm upset about something, I say it. I might not be really good with how I, how I say things. Sometimes I say them with a lot of anger and then I end up saying things that I do regret after some time, but I cannot hide them. I have to say them immediately. If I don't say them immediately, I'm going to be sour for the next like day or whatever. So I have just learned that sometimes you just need to speak your peace and speak your truth and keep it moving. So, yeah. Can you drive a stick shift? Yes. Currently, I drive an automatic, but yes, I can drive a stick shift. I'm very bad at it because I've been driving automatic for how many years now? But I can try. I mean, if I was pressed and I had to go to the hospital and take someone to the hospital and there was just a stick shift, yes, I will remember, it will come back to me, but yeah, good job. 15, do you care if people talk badly about you? If it's, if it's family members, I do care. I do care if it's people that I hold closely and dearly to my heart, like um, my immediate family and things like that. I do care, of course I care. I mean, I've got feelings, I'm not that robot. You know, I do care. But if it's like people that I do not know from a bar of soap, like I cannot even pick you out between, I could not care less. Like I've learned that people are gonna like you, some people are gonna like you, some people are not gonna like you, and that's just how it is, that's life. And um, you know, sometimes they, they're not gonna like you, but they're going to want to make their opinion of you known, so they're gonna say horrible things about you or whatever, and that's fine, they can, they can do that, you know, whatever makes you sleep at night. But for me, my father loves to say, and I'm gonna say this in Sutu because that's how, that's my home language and that's how he says it, but he normally says that if muto how regularly get your penti then we're shaking. So that's what I have ad adapted in my life. Um, are you going out of town soon? I certainly wish I was, but I'm not. Uh, I'm just not. Okay, I'm not. Um, when was the last time you cried? Whew. When was the last time I cried? A couple of weeks ago. A couple of weeks ago, we were, we were going through a thing, you know, in the family and I cried. I cried. I'm a big crybaby. Shut I could have cried like last week watching a movie. I could have because I cry with movies as well. So I'm not quite sure. But the, 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 the one that I do remember for sure is a couple of weeks ago. Number 18. Have you ever liked someone you didn't expect to? Absolutely. Absolutely. And you know, he didn't like me back. And I was just like, you stupid anyway. But... Yeah, I, I did. I did. A couple of times I liked people that it's almost like you feel like he's he's not even in my league. Why am I liking him? <laughs> but but you do, you know it happens from time to time. You just is my lash falling off, okay? You just end up liking someone that you never thought you'd like. If you could change your eye colour, what would would you and what colour would it be? No. I would not change my eye colour. I love my brown eyes. No, I love my brown eyes, so no, no, no. Name something you have to do tomorrow. Tomorrow I have to uh, see my aunt and see a person. And <laughs> yeah, upload a giveaway video. Those are three things that I need to do tomorrow. See my aunt, see a person, and upload a video. Okay, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's a little bit of an invade my privacy tag for you. Uh, I tag everyone who would love to do this video to do it. Um, I tag all my YouTube buddies and I would love to see them do this video because it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. The questions are a little bit invasive, but they, they're all right. They're all right. Uh, but yeah, that's it from me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to go now. I have a giveaway video to edit. So yeah, I will see you in the next one.